What's up guys, Boyle 96 hd here. I am back and I'm doing something different for you uh, today. I'm doing a live comm with the squad builder you've seen there a few days ago. It's a really nice team and uh, just something different I think you may enjoy. I'm going to do all live comm, so if you want to see something more like this, leave a comment below. But then again, if you do want coins, check out www.utcointraders.com or ultimateteamcoiters.com. Uh, links are also in the description. They're not going to let you down. Cheap and reliable site. Anyway, the team we're playing with, if you haven't seen the squad, we'll leave Czech, Boateng, Luis. Smalling, Carrick, Gustavo, and then Shakiri and Nani on the wings, and Rooney, Muriel, and Di Natale. So we're going to go into Division 1, we're going to do a bit of a live comm, and hopefully we can win. So we'll see what it's like, we'll see if we can win the game, it would be nice. Maybe the first off would be nice to get an opponent, come on EA, come on, come on, give me an opponent. There we go, what lightning say we're going to get, 2 bar, 2 bar, oh should we do it, if it's bad lag, lads, it shouldn't be though. Come on, where's x Bollex? good lad. Uh, yeah. This is a nice kit action I did get in the pack. I'm just done after watching the football this Saturday when I'm recording this. There was a lot of Arsenal were absolutely terrible. I was watching the Arsenal game and Steve Sidwell got sent off within f 10 minutes. And just Arsenal were shit ever since. They were lucky to get the one goal lead. Fulham were unlucky actually. They played well with 10 men. But um, yeah, this team is a nice Serie A team. The likes of Buffon, Chiellini, Alexander Pato, and Balotelli. That's a very nice team. It's mostly all Milan. I see a lot of Milan in there. One, two, three, four, five, six Milan players. Seven. I don't know. But anyway, let's see what we can do with this team. Muriel and Dina Talle hopefully can provide the goods for me. And Wayne Rooney providing them. It is going to make it obviously better for me anyway. So I'd appreciate if you press X, mate. I mean, oh my god, cunts that don't press X. They just do your bollocks in. X button is there to be pressed, pal. Come on. Come on. Come on. Press X. Fuck me, pink. What did they be doing? Just press the X button. There we go. Good lad. Anyway, as usually, I go defensive with a 3-5-2 formation. So we we'll start off. Hopefully, the lag isn't too bad. And hopefully, we can win a game here. Nice on recording. Shkiri, a fantastic, fantastic right mid. Here it goes. He takes a pass. One. Get a oh, my fuck. I thought you'd force out. Please tell me that's a corner. Just There has to be a corner. Oh, good. I thought that was just an absolutely a horrible shot. Ball's up to in. Up for it. Up for it. Go lasso after one minute. Louis Gustavo. Three minutes even. More first attack really from that. And that has a lovely start for me. The Serie A team takes a notch down. And that was a lovely, lovely finish. But Gustavo from corners. He has the height and he has the heading ability. So he does score a lot of the time for me. But uh, Muriel is a fantastic player. I've seen a lot of people ask me on Twitter. Do I recommend using him? He is. I know his non inform is so overpowered. Which kind of you think about his inform. You're going to go. Is he much better? But uh, he's a fantastic player. I really enjoy playing with him, and hopefully he can provide something for this game to kind of prove that for you that I th thought he was that good. Rooney and Cam is kind of interesting to play with. He's really good for me, and then some people call him really bad. I don't know it's kind of kind of preference really matters with this fucking with a lot of players this year, as you can see that passing from Carrick, uh, Carrick's in form passing is absolutely amazing. Me being a fella who thinks he's really really good in real life passing wise and for United this year but he's kind of an on and off player but uh, hopefully he does get a team of the season card because he'll be really really fun to play with his passing will be insane no doubt he's not going to have the pace to do it for you but otherwise he will be nice come on Di Natale yeah if you notice you're like Jesus you're probably doing a bit of skills what is life but uh, no all I can do is a Ronaldo chop that's literally all I can do either a Ronaldo chop and I could do a fucking oh what do you call it no scoop turn I don't even know what it's called oh my god corner OP 2-0 up Jerome Boateng uh, I can see a rage quit on the cards here. Hopefully not, because I'm doing a live comm. If you don't play from 9 minutes, you're a bell end. Come on, county balls. Oh, he is. Should I, should I just, just let him score, shouldn't I? I don't want to rage quit. Anyway, this is Division 1. Jesus, this guy is dire. Me saying that, he'll probably go down and fucking score too. But uh, yeah, David Luiz is just so fucking... I, I, I actually cry when I come up against him. I'd say when people just have really, really expensive players like Messi and Ronaldo... And David Luiz just somehow catches up with them and just goes, no, you're not getting by me. It's so disheartening. He's just so fucking overpowered. It's oh, it's crazy to play against. I don't know what EA do with him. Even with his high attacking work rates, he seems to always just be there. Look, he's, he's the only defender back here. Your man should score here, and he does. Me calling him shit. El Shadaway makes it. Whoa, 2-1, two 2-1. One, two one. If you watch your goal, I will make you pay. I will tramp you, you cunt. But um, 
this team, I said in the squad builder the other day, I played like 10 games, I've played a good few games right now, I think I'm out to 20 or 25 games at this rate, but uh, it's a fun team to play with, it's like, I really am enjoying playing with it, it has a bit of everything to it, kind of, in my opinion, Di Natale and Muriel are an absolutely fantastic strike line, if anybody has played with them, they get perfect nine chemistry, so they're doing me well, let's see what Nani can do here, it's not even Nani, is it, it's Nani, that's a penalty, that's a penalty, that's a fucking penalty, ball sack, oh, Balotelli, Balotelli also one of uh, amazing striker as you can see a character in the CDM job there and I literally just do play a cross field balls so I can kind of have fun with his passing I don't, they're pointless but I do them Shakiri's pace is fucking lightning and uh, let's get on he's left footed isn't he he is why they do that that was sh fucking stupid I abused the Ronaldo chop I literally do once I get my hands on a four star skiller there's OP David Luis back to Shakiri. Shakiri waits for the run. You see, oh, that was a fucking great interception. The Nelly De Rossi. But um, as I said, sorry if this live com isn't fucking the best that you've seen. Obviously, I've only done I think two in the past, and they went down really well. So I decided to do one now, and because uh, I decided to be something different for a video on my channel. Coming up to team of the year too. What do you reckon, Van Persie? I'm hoping he gets one. He kind of has to get one, especially if United win the league. And if you know you don't win the league now, I'm done. Me as a United fan, I was in the pub with, my f with a few mates last year, watching that City game. Thought we had the league, and I, oh, I'm telling you, I'm honest, lads. I actually broke into tears in that fucking game after that Conteguero scored. Fantastic player, but that dib shit, Joey Barton, or whatever he was doing. And apologies once again about my cursing. If you are watching it, and if you've even made it in this far. I know a lot of you don't like my cursing, but it's the way I am. I'll try and cut down a bit in it. But leave in the comments below how many of you don't mind me cursing and how many of you think I curse a lot. I'm telling you, I try. I even tried before this video that I said I wouldn't curse so much. But you know yourself, lads. FIFA does get you fucking roaring all sorts of abuse. Nanny, I hate this guy in real life, but he's so so good in FIFA. Got take a deflection. I nearly creeped in the bottom corner. We're into what is it? only 27 minutes gone. I'll oh, go on three goals from corners. Oh my. God, my fucking team is so OP from corners. Jerome Boateng, non informed is my favourite defender in the game. I know David Luiz and all, but I just think Boateng's amazing, and his inform's only fucking better. It's so, so fun to play with. Oh, Muriel. Oh, fucking Dean Natale went to ground there. Shouldn't have really went down. Shakuri. Shakuri. Maybe I'm pronouncing them wrong. I always make fun of people saying fucking what they do. I think it's Shakiri, isn't it? Lads, any of you that know how to pronounce Shakiri, and if I'm doing it right, let me know in the comments. Anyway, let's get a long shot away with him. Oh, what a fucking goal! Oh my god, that was beautiful! What happened to my voice there, I don't know. Fucking hell, that was amazing. Oh my god, I feel like such a bellend for doing that voice. My voice just broke midway. Fucking hell, Shakiri. Oh my holy fill fucking a stick. That was absolutely beautiful. I can't believe I was recording and I went in. Oh my god, anyway lads, I apologise. Oh my god, if you had headphones on there, I am so sorry. That was the biggest fucking bit screen I've ever done. Anyway, this is that was a, a nice goal to say the least. It does show a nice representation for the team. Nanny doing some skills. Oh, let's see. Let's see, come on. Pato, please. Pato, 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 mate. Do you not know David Luis is tracking you? But um, yeah, I was going to do a Team of the Season prediction video. I'm still laughing over that reaction. Uh, I was going to do a Team of the Season prediction video because I've seen a few people doing them. And I have a few of them, a few decisions that I've seen on people like No Fellaini in it, which I've seen is a bit crazy. But uh, I decided I may as well just talk a bit about it in this video. And uh, a lot of people have asked on Twitter, what do I think my predicted Team of the Season for the Premier League will be? As me being a Premier League fucking supporter, a Manchester United supporter, I watch Premier League week in, week out, and I wouldn't miss a week of the Premier League. So I watch enough of it, in my opinion, to get a brief out the overview of what who I think will be in it. And seriously, it'll gonna, it's going to be different because EA are going to choose it, in my opinion, and money-wise. like People like Vincent Company will shouldn't be in there. I don't think he's been good enough, but I think he will be in there. But for me, I'm going to start in 11 wise I feel the hail being goals. I feel Raphael or Zabaleta are right back. Either way, one will be on the bench. That won't make much of a difference, and one will be in the team. I think that's definite for me. You will have centre-back Jan Vertonghen, 100%. He's played amazing for Tottenham this season, and he's got them to a fourth place or fifth place at the moment. He has to be in there, in my opinion. Who else will you have? Left-back Leighton Baines, that's guaranteed. I think yeah, I really do hate him. They only give him like a non-rare card every year, and I think he deserves an 83-84 card. 
Uh, centre mid, you'll have, I don't know what if he'll be centre mid, but he'll be in the team. Michu, he may be a centre forward or a striker, but uh, he'll be in that. Matt, he'll definitely be in there. I think he has 18 goals and 32 assists as his video's being recorded, which is amazing for a midfielder. Just absolutely crazy and amazing season he's played. Uh, who else would you have? Carrick may see an appearance. I don't know. It depends. He deserves it, in my opinion, but I don't know if he'll make it in there. Flaney is a guaranteed. He's got everything to where they are. He has to be in there. Bale, too. Bale's been Tottenham's man going forward, and he's done it each game he's played. Who else would you have? You'll have, uh, obviously, Suarez and Van Persie have to be in there. They just have to be in there. And that Van Persie card will be mine. I've been dying for an inform since day one of Ultimate Team. So when I get him... He will be fucking never sold. Here's Muriel showing his pace. Muriel get a shot away, lad. Yeah, beauty. Muriel there. Oh, geez, it's a nice game to do a live come on, to say the least. But, um, yeah, who else do I think? Bench-wise, you're going to have the likes of Begovic, or you may have Mignolet. Probably Begovic. Then you'll have Zabala, I said, or Raphael, so they'll be on the bench. Maybe Ricky Lambert. I'm not too sure. Will he get an appearance? Uh, I don't know. It's, he may do and he may not. It really depends. Lukaku may get one too. I don't know about him. I think he could deserve one. Who am I forgetting? I always forget one. Lampard. He scored a good few goals for Chelsea this year. Uh, I think he des may deserve a shout as well. Uh, who else? Centre back wise, maybe. Uh, United. I don't think would deserve any more. Wigan City. Aston Villa. Benteke. There we go. Benteke deserves some sort of a shout. Especially if Villa do say up. He has been a lot of their goals have came from Benteke this season he's scored a many a many a goal and um, if you do keep Villa up he'll be a big big player to hold on to if they can in the summer oh here we go doing Tale but that's basically what I think the team season if you have watched this video I'm very happy I'm surprised if anybody's this fair you've probably turned it off after that Shakira reaction anyway but um, yeah as I said if you've watched so far leave a comment below what do you think team of the season wise? Do you think would you agree or would you disagree with any players that I've said there? Or who would you add in even if that's even a better way of saying it? But geez, I'm really loving Muriel here. He's fucking he, him and Dean Natalia rip shit up. This is unbelievable pace. Gets that shot away. Oh fantastic save from Buffon. Probably one of the most solid keepers on the game for me anyway. Let's see if we get third goal from corners. If if I do I'd rage quit if I was I was this man. Buffon just manhandled me. What the fuck? This fella's going with a stupid throw. Shakiri intercepts. I'm not going to take a shot because I don't want that same reaction to happen. It was so disappointing. All right, mate, you hit out for a corner. <laughs> Cheers for that. Uh, Rooney whips it in. Up for it, up for it, up for it. Oh, how did you miss, pal? Oh, fucking Muriel there. Jeez, I found him really. I find him really, really good. That balance of that speed and that dribbling makes him a fantastic, fantastic player to play with. Um, I think he got this in the to get two goals and one assist or something. I don't know, uh, David Luiz. I don't even, I don't even, can you ever doubt David Luiz getting the ball? He's so, so good. Louis Gustavo breaks, he plays it out. It's Adine Dale. Dino Dale, oh, he's so good, Dino Dale. He's shooting this top notch, top drawer. Oh, could save from Buffon. This man's lucky with Buffon, it could be 8 or 9 1 if he fucking didn't. Uh, ball's whipped in again. Oh my god, Buffon keeping this fella in this. Dino Dale again. Oh, God, Jesus, you nearly got a bit of AIDS there. That was a great reflex from Buffon to save it. Um, if you do want more of these, lads, leave in the comments what topics I can talk about. Uh, you know, I could talk about fucking football all day, but uh, it'd be something, maybe something different if you want to hear me talk about any topics, IRL or whatever. That Boston bom bombings, and i just seen your man was fucking caught last night. The fellow that they were fucking on running away for running spree. But uh, that's terrible. Fucking stuff like that is just crazy. It's hard to think just fucking people like that in the world. But uh, anyway, as I said, if you want any topics like that in my videos, let me know in uh, the comments description. I always read the comments and I take everything into 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 consideration. So I try to improve my videos. Even if you see anything wrong with this video, if you feel that I should improve on something, leave in the comments. I always try to improve, as I said. Anyway, this fella's getting the dense sausage. Um, there's no odd chance for him coming back. No chance at all. Pato there runs it out of play. I'd say this guy's fucking close to smashing his controller off the ground. All right, let's do this now. I swore he's AFK at times. He's just not really. I don't know. He seems to be not tackling me at times. I see him running there at the AI. Uh, right, let's do this, Shikiri. Cut in. Lovely. Get the shot away. Oh, lads, if you haven't played with Shikiri, let's all price fix him. Did you see that for a goal? He deserves to be 50k. 
I'm so pissed off as the uh, informers, man. The match card is a left left mid, is it? No, it's a yeah, it's a left mid. If he was right mid, he'd fit in this team absolutely juicy. But he's not. He's a fucking oh, Balotelli. Fuck off. Fuck off, mate. Yeah, good boy, Jack. Good lad. Good lad. Rooney. I found Rooney really, really good, and he just look how he just pings the passes. He works really well. Gustavo is just so so good on every FIFA. Um, your or Di Natale is a cracking shot. Oh, good save. This guy's Buffon, i got to be honest. He's kind of keeping him in it. Ah, Muriel, that was a wank touch. Wank, wanky do wank, wank, wank. Uh, De Rossi, De Rossi. That's mine. That's mine. Yeah. Get away, Shakiri. Oh, all I'm going to do is shoot, and I apologise for my shit long shots. I should really just edit out that reaction. No, I'm only joking, though, lads. That was, a, that was an overreaction, to say the least. Anyway, De Natale, going to finish this off. I couldn't tramp it. Does he deserve it? No. Lol, oh my god, oh my god, I'm such a cunt of a FIFA player, I deserve that so badly, wow, if I deserve a dislike, oh my god, that was so bad, <laughs> I decided to double tramp him, actually no, I didn't, didn't mean to do the second tramp, I tried to be a fucking cocky prick and flick it into the goals, but a fail, go on, he deserves to score from here, I just know he's not going to score again, because he's kind of really shit, so I should fucking, he hasn't tramped me, so I shouldn't tramp him, I normally work on that basis, so I apologise for being a cunt, lads. <laughs> but uh, this guy, it could be a lot more, as I've said. This guy's just been fucking... I think he's getting really pissed off. I just... What else? I can't think of... Oh, the scoop turn. Di Natale. Oh, get ahead in it, get ahead in it. Oh, come on, dropped me. How the fuck is that hit free? The amount of fucking bollocks that you get free for in this game is crazy. Like that pulling in the shirt option, you'd never get a free from that. And you could just tap the bastard, even if it wasn't you, it was computer wise, and you'd get a free. Some something sometimes in this game is just stupid. You got another free. For what? Wow, fuck you, game. Fuck you, game. Uh, Agbana. Agbana has, I would call him one of the most overpowered fuckers there is. But uh, not in this game, no. Not in this game. He has got the sausage. He has got the sausage. Right. Nani, I fucking love this guy. He's so, so good in this game. I keep saying in this game because it really does show how much hatred I have for the prick in real life. Agbana just fucking cream here. Let's score this free kick. Come on. Come on, Rooney. Do it, Roo. Do it, Roo. Do it, Roo. It's up. It's on. Oh, Buffon's fucking amazing. Oh, that was a great save by Gianluigi Buffon. Uh, another goal from the corner, maybe. Oh, my God. This game. This game. I could have a lot more goals. I could have a lot more goals. Right, it is Boateng. He's already got one from a corner. Is he gonna go on at it himself? He plays a true Muriel, and there it is. There's the fifth Muriel, Louis Muriel, kind of sealing off this game if it wasn't sealed off already. Um, was an amazing goal, I think. Or not amazing goal. It was an amazing header. No, it wasn't really, was it? It was just a nice header. Yeah, I don't even know what I'm fucking milking it up about. It was a decent header. This guy has got the sausage. 5-1. You are not the king anymore. Sorry, pal. Uh, go on, go and score on goals. Make it a bit comical. I advise you to play keep goals. Not a bad idea, so you don't concede anymore. Okay, just give it back to me. Can we get one more? I think that's... I think he'd blow it anyway, but hopefully we can get something out of this. Something out of this. I mean, something, another goal. Let's see if Nani can match you, Kiri. Come on, bounce to Muriel. Don't go out and play. Don't go out and play. That's in. He has that. And anyway. Oh. Anyway, lads, if you watched this far, thank you very much for watching. Leave a like, leave a comment, and uh, have a fantastic day. Goodbye. And by the way, if you want cheap coins, check out the description. <laughs> See you later, lads. Bye-bye.